What is a good way I could get Gandalf? Here, use this! This is the first of six simple machines. It's called a wedge! <laughs> the wedge, part one of our six part simple machine series. A wedge is a simple machine used to push two objects apart. A wedge is made up of two inclined planes. These planes meet and form a sharp edge, and this edge can split things apart. Some examples of wedges are knives, axes, forks, and nails. Oh, that's not right. You want to get your revenge, Gandalf? Okay. Well, here's simple machine number two. The lever. The Lever, part two of our six-part Simple Machine series. A lever is a border bar that rests at a turning point. This turning point is called the fulcrum. An object that a lever moves is called the load. The closer the object is to the fulcrum, the easier it is to move. Some examples of levers are bottle openers and crowbars. You don't know how to use it? Let me help. Gandalf, you want to kill him, eh? Well, why don't you hang him using this device? It's called a pulley. The pulley, part three of our six part simple machine series. This simple machine is made up of a wheel and a rope. The rope fits on the groove of the wheel. One part of the rope is attached to the load. When you pull on one side of the pulley, the wheel turns and the load will move. Pulleys let you move loads up, down, or sideways. Pulleys are good for moving objects to hard to reach places. It also makes work of moving heavy loads a lot easier. Some examples of pulleys are flag poles, clothes lines, a sailboat, blinds and a crane. Take that! Having trouble, Gandalf? Here! I'll give you a wheelbarrow, which just so happens to have our fourth simple machine already attached to it. The wheel and axle, part four of our six-part simple machine series. The wheel and axle is another simple machine. The axle is a rod that goes to the wheel and lets the wheel turn. This makes it easy to move heavy objects from place to place. Some examples of wheels and axles are cars, roller skates, wagons, and doorknobs. It seems you're using an inclined plane. The inclined plane. Part 5 of our 6 part simple machine series. An inclined plane is a flat surface that is higher on one end. You can use this machine to move an object to a lower or higher plane. Inclined planes make the work of moving things easier. You would need less energy and force to move objects with an inclined plane. Some examples of inclined planes are a ramp, a slanted road, a path up a hill, and a slide. I close the coffin? Here, use the screw. Oh, oh, not that screw, Gandalf. Yes, that screw. The screw. Part six of our six part simple machine series. A screw is a simple machine that is made up from another simple machine. It is actually an inclined plane that winds around itself. A screw has ridges and is not smooth like a nail. Some screws are used to lower and raise things. They are also used to hold objects together. Some examples of screws are light bulbs, clamps, jacks, and a drill bit. Oh, Gandalf. Yes, this works much better. Do, 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 do.